Well, probably the f past five years we have bandied about the notion of buying a permanent home for Valdosta Lowndes County Industrial Commission. And when I joined this board some almost four years ago, that was a hot topic item. In fact, immediately before joining the board, there was some consideration of buying a building that Cheryl and I owned over on Patterson Street at or about the location of Gordon and Patterson. The matter <clears throat> did not take legs and was tabled or postponed and about two years ago the issue came up again. We engaged the services of our, services of our professionals, Mr. Davis and Mr. Gupton. We appointed a committee which included Mr. Call being the chairperson of that committee, as I recall, Mr. Paul, <clears throat> to begin an active search for a home for Long Island Labs County Industrial Authority. And we looked and we looked and we looked. The commission chair at the time, uh, Mr. Paul and I, looked at uh, a section of land near the new courthouse. And I think your committee, Mr. Cole, may have looked as well. Uh, we took a tour of the old courthouse with the notion that somehow that grand old lady could be renovated to our satisfaction. We came to the conclusion that that was unworkable. And we looked at several other buildings. Of course, <clears throat> during the course of this quest to find a home for the Valdosta Lowndes County Industrial Authority, we set certain parameters. I think, Mr. Jeanette, you may have sat on a committee at some point as well. It seems like it's been going on a lot more than five years. Okay, it probably has. <laughs> I'm giving you yeah, the history you. of this search uh, from my point on, on this board. And the parameters were set as follows. You know, somewhere north of the new courthouse, between Ashley and Patterson Street, up to and about North Side Drive, as I recall. And we eliminated a lot of of, of location simply because they were either unsuitable from a space and parking vantage point or more to the point they're just too doggone expensive and as we eliminated for various reasons properties this property on Roosevelt Drive the old heritage bank building uh, which is now a hub of economic and development construction activities this is a site that we decided upon I think that each member of this board has been consulted with numerous times, probably more times than, than you wanted, but because this is something that we consider important for the community and for the board, we wanted your input. We asked Mr. Davis to do an economic analysis of this purchase. And Mr. Davis, I don't know if you want to speak to that, but I, I think it would be appropriate um, since we got the newspaper in. Mr. Quarterman here. Talk to us about the economic side. What are the